flute. I wish I could just start off videos like that. Like no effort at all, just, hey, how's it going? I've got a flute, let's try the flute. But no, I have to put the bells and whistles on it. Maybe I could just do that. I don't think anyone would actually care. Either way, let's just stick to the norm for now, shall we? So a while back, if you remember, we were sent a couple of recorders to try out on the channel. And the only reason we were sent them was because we wanted to try out a flute. And the guys who sent them to us were like, hey, you've never played a flute. You should probably play something a little bit easier. So after playing the recorders for a few hours, about a month ago, I think I'm now more than qualified to try playing a flute. This is going to go really badly, isn't it? I feel sorry to any flute players out there who are going on this channel expecting to hear something maybe even slightly good. This is the first time I'm ever trying out a flute. It's not gonna sound good. I haven't even done much research. I don't really know much about this instrument at all. I just wanted to come on here blind and try playing a flute, because why not? It's my channel, I can do what I want. I've misplaced my knife. How am I meant to get into this? This looks sharp. I'm always impressed by Donna's bags. Despite being quite a cheap brand, they do go all out with the bags. So in this bag, we've got a stick. Is this a tranquilizer dart? Oh, it's a tiny screwdriver, of course. Gloves, two different types of rags. We've got a pot of wax, a shoulder strap for the bag. And in the main compartment, we've got <laughs> the flute itself. Comes in three parts. And I'm going to assume it's quite easy assembly. No. How to play flute. That's probably record time for me having to Google something on one of these videos. <laughs> Beginners crash course to playing the flute. That's, oh, 26 minutes long. No, 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 no. Three minutes, there we go. How to make a sound, perfect, that's what I need. Okay, so I need a small, consistent stream of air going over the aperture, kind of like blowing a glass bottle, which I know I can do, so hopefully this won't take long to crack. Why doesn't mine sound like that? My biggest piece of advice for any brand new flute student that just got their first flute would be don't rush to put the entire flute together. I know it's really tempting to just put everything together. Pretty calling me out on this one. For the first time ever in a video, I'm gonna remove my lip stud. All those people who've been telling me to remove this thing for literally years, rejoice! It's finally happened. <laughs> I'm gonna pass out if I keep going this way. I need to find the right technique. So Take a breath. I'm so happy. Not we're getting there, lads. It only took 40 minutes, but we're getting there. <laughs> oh, I've lost it. <laughs> Step one complete. We've made a sound. Was it the right sound? I'm not 100% sure, but it was a sound and it was a consistent sound and that's what we're after. <laughs> I see how it is. Let's sign to his DMs, ask if he wants a flute. That'll make him look stupid. Well, good on you, Donna. You were right. I do look stupid. <laughs> I feel woozy. I feel like we're getting somewhere, but I feel like it's also kind of going nowhere at the same time. As soon as I try this again, it's not gonna sound anywhere near as good as that, and it didn't sound good to begin with, so it's just gonna sound even more garbage. <laughs> See, there it is. Oh my God, it's like it's just luck at this point. It's just luck. I knew playing the flute was going to be hard, and my god it is, but it is so damn satisfying when you make some kind of sound with it. Even if it is a shoddy B, C, G, whatever it is, it feels good when you finally get it. It requires such finesse to make it sound good, and that's something I definitely don't have. But honestly, if you asked me half an hour ago, I would have said, I'm never gonna be able to pull off a note with this thing. But persistence is key, my dudes, persistence is key. <laughs> So 
So it's been a week and after a bit of practice, I feel like I've come quite far in my flute playing endeavors. And when I say I've come quite far, I mean I now know how to hold it and I can now make a sound with it. And apart from that, not much else has changed. It still sounds pretty bad. But let's show you what I've got. It's still very airy, I'm struggling to make a really nice clean sound with it, but at least it's a sound. <laughs> if you couldn't tell, I, I don't really know how to play any songs on this thing yet, I'm not even 100% sure where all the notes are, but look, it's getting there. <laughs> so yeah, suffice to say I still have quite a long way to go, turns out a week is not long enough to master everything that you need to know about the flute. The flute is definitely an instrument that I want to practice more with, though I've never really had that much interest in wind instruments, this one is just kind of tickling my fancy. On paper it's quite a simple instrument, but it's a very hard instrument to master. This is why I've always liked the drums, because I just need to hit the pads and the cymbals in the right order, where Whereas this, I need to make sure my lips are in the right position. I need to blow consistently without passing out. All things I don't have to worry about when playing the drums, but with this, I, I need to get good at. Now, I could wrap this video up here, but I really don't want to. I want to go ahead and make some weird sounds with this thing. And this is probably the part where everybody's going to leave because they don't want their ears to bleed. But if you want to hear some noisy noise, stick around. It's about to get messy. You know what? I'm only getting worse. I'm gonna stop here. <laughs> I don't know what it is about playing the flute, but if I play it for more than like 10, 20 minutes, I just get even worse. I start off bad, I hit about the five minute mark, I start improving, and it hits 10 minutes, 15 minutes, and it's all downhill from there. I can't even make a sound with it. I don't know what's going on. Well, I think that's all we've got time for today. So with that, I think that's going to be it for another edition of Looted. Shout out to Keegan McAdams, Natasha Savage, Pikachu, Luna, George Acock, Luke Rees, and Chance McTire on Patreon. Thank you very much for your support. And if you like this video, hit like. If you like all our videos, hit subscribe. I've got more videos on the way. If you want to support the channel further, check out the link in the description to our Patreon page. And you can also join us on our Discord server. We'll see you guys in the next one. Have a good one.